Hi, this is Leslie Goldman from the Plant Your Dream blog. I'm down here at a building that we should all know in San Diego. And I want to introduce you to Ray Lutz, who's done an incredible job here. What's the name of the organization that you've got started? Citizens Oversight, citizensoversight.org. Uh, yeah, today we had a great turnout from uh, activists, uh, mostly Bernie Sanders supporters that are interested in the result. Uh, we think that the number of uh, ballots that were cast late as provisionals at the polling place, um, they should not have been provisionals, but they were treated that way, and therefore they're not included in the tally at this point. And so the number of those here in San Diego is 74,000, and it's far beyond the difference between Hillary and, and Bernie here in this county. Mm -hmm. And statewide, I understand it's a similar situation in all counties. Already three counties have flipped over to Bernie's side. And so we may see the whole state uh, flip over to Bernie. So the, the uh, you know, that could really change things. It could mean that Bernie Sanders has a lot more muscle when it comes to the convention. Um, to okay. get his uh, platform positions in, maybe to convince Hillary to become a little bit more progressive on some some things. Who knows? Let me ask you one more question. So, um, uh, you'll be spending more time down here in the next 30 days, or, or you want other volunteers down Absolutely. here? Absolutely. There's places for more volunteers. There's a lot of places where we're going to be doing our work now, but there's more things coming up once we get the uh, once they free up some of the documents that we want to look at and and capture, especially the rosters, the sign-in rosters at the polling places. We want to get uh, a number of how many people actually submitted those provisional ballots to make sure that they weren't lost along the way so mm -hmm. that we can track them all the way through. And we can't get that th that information until a bit later. Okay. But then we want people to come in and even if you have 10 people working, even getting a 10% uh, review of that is still going to take more than a week. So it's okay. a lot of work that we need people with. Well, congratulations, Ray. Thanks for getting us all inspired and looks like we're going to own this place before uh, too long. Well, basically, you it's know, a civics lesson. it's not just the vote. It's actually holding their feet to the fire and holding organizations to the fire like this throughout time. As in a democracy, you have to do your part to oversee it. And that's what Citizens Oversight is all about. Okay. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Bye.